A state representative is asking the state to fund her mission to help end homelessness in Albuquerque. She's hoping she can do that with the help of UNM. Here's News 13's Jeannie Nguyen. Jeannie. Jackie, this state representative is hoping a new study will be the solution to solving this longtime problem. It's a request for public research funding from the University of New Mexico. State Representative Dan Hockman V. Hill is hoping pre-filed House Bill 19 will be the answer to fixing the homeless problem in Albuquerque. To study homelessness in Al the city of Albuquerque in Bernalillo County to help appropriately plan for um, housing communities. The bill would appropriate $372,000 from the state's general fund to the Board of Regents at UNM to conduct a study on homelessness. Don't pick something in Wells Park that already got hammered. This comes shortly after the city of Albuquerque held a public meeting for people to weigh in on where the voter-approved $30 million homeless shelter should go. The city currently has nine potential sites, but it raised a lot of questions from citizens. It operates 24-7. But the doors may not be open 24 oh, yeah. While Huckman Beehill says this study will look at where to place homeless shelters, she wants to make clear that it will also study the issue in depth to find out what is adding to the problem. Whether or not we have zoning regulations that are contributing to homelessness as well. Huckman Beehill says the study will also look into the controversial tiny home village to determine if that will be a solution to homelessness. It's by doing things like this, really studying the issue and making sure that we are making the best decisions we can. And there's no time frame on how long this study will take if the bill passes. Jackie, back to you. Okay, thanks, Jeannie. Huckman V. Hill will introduce House Bill 19 during the upcoming legislative session that starts on January 21st.